Recently, it was announced that the U.S. government is taking a 10% stake and Intel. And then also there's the other flip, I think it was 15% of revenues from AMD and NVIDIA. What is your thought about that and how it might affect the space? Um, well, I mean, look, in terms of how it might affect the space, I think it's not going to have ever big, a big impact. I'll be honest. I think, you know, it's uh, AMD and uh, NVIDIA for me are the big players and, you know, potentially the winners of the next phase of AI. I don't think that a 15% um, fee to the US government is going to change massively, you know, their research and development, their potential. I think, you know, it's not something that you can change uh, with a centrally, with a central governmental intervention. You're not going to be able to change something that is in the make for, you know, decades of investments and so on. Uh, Intel, on the other end, I think it's on the other end of the spectrum. I think they lost their AI race. Uh, I think it's going to be very difficult for them to catch up. Uh, I mean, the Chinese are trying to catch up since a while and the Chinese are throwing a lot more resources than, you know, uh, 11 billion stake or whatever it is. Uh, and I don't think that's really going to be able to change for them. I wouldn't be bullish on Intel or bearish on AMD and Nvidia because of this news. Uh, I don't think it's the space, I mean, the technology is so developed and so advanced. I don't think it's the kind of space where you can really change uh, the future by uh, you know, investing, uh, with a government investing a stake in, in a company. Uh, so yeah, I don't think it's you know I, I see those noise <laughs> more than anything else in the cost in the context of investing in semiconductors.